Welcome to New York. We arrived in New York last night after an interesting <laughs> day of traveling. Um, first of all, there was loads of fog in Aberdeen, so our flight was delayed, which meant that our we missed our flight from London Heathrow to New York, which was annoying, but we managed to get on another flight, so all is well. We arrived last night at about, what time did we arrive, Pete? Here. Yeah, about half past um, to the hotel. Yeah, we arrived at the hotel about half past six, seven o'clock and then we chilled out for a bit and then we went to Target to pick up some supplies, which I can show you later. Just a bunch of American junk food, really. And yeah, we have just got ready this morning. It is nine o'clock. We got up very early at like half past six and we are going out to explore. I think the first thing on the plan for today is to get a bagel because I really want a bagel. And then we are going to do some shopping. We might walk the Chelsea High Line. The sun looks to be shining and it's supposed to be pretty warm, so... Yeah, we are going to go out and seize the day. But first of all, I want to do a little room tour. The room is a little bit of a mess because we have moved in already and all of my stuff is everywhere all over the bedside table. But I'll give you a little tour. We're staying at the Hotel Indigo Lower East Side. Uh, we didn't really want to stay up near Times Square this time because we've both been here before many, many years ago. And yeah, we feel like we've done staying in the whole touristy area and we wanted to experience a different area so yeah i'm going to show you the room so as you come in the door we have quite a large wardrobe uh, actually in there for all of our stuff and then the bathroom is here hello <laughs> um it's a really big bathroom actually i like these tiles on the floor as well so we have the mirror of course and the sink and a nice shelf to put all of our bits and bobs and i love this shower it is absolutely huge and the rainfall shower is really really nice as well so that is our bathroom oh i just leaned on the sink and it was wet and now i am all wet on my back so this is our room again apologies for the mess because we have moved in here is peter chilling on the very big bed it was very nice last night we have tables so we can put all of our stuff and there is a full length mirror which is good because sometimes hotels do not have a full length mirror so that's nice big TV. I think this is an ice bucket, but I never found a ice machine yesterday. They bring, it. They bring you the ice. Yeah. Okay. We've got mini bar in here and we pay this um, like amenity every day, which means that we can get $20 worth from the mini bar. There's also snacks in here, which we haven't taken anything. And also the coffee machine in here. And there's a little desk, we have a little chair. Here's our suitcases, of course. And here's our view out the window, it's nothing special. We are on the sixth floor. You can see some buildings over there, but yeah, because we're so low down, we don't really have much of a view. Um, but that's fine because, actually, let me turn around the camera. It's actually better that we're lower down because there is a rooftop bar at the hotel and it seems quite, party central so if we were any higher up I think we would get a lot of noise from the bar and yeah I think we're getting old and we like to sleep quite early so um yeah it's good that we didn't get any noise last night just some noise this morning which we think might have been a washing machine somewhere it was going doom 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 and um, so that was a bit annoying but yeah we are going to leave now and we're going to get bagel and do some shopping Woo! So Pete's not ready as per usual, always Whoa. waiting on him to put on his shoes and get ready. I thought I would do a little haul of what we bought in Target last night. So I've never tried goldfish before, so we thought we'd give them a try, extra cheddar. I think they're just like cheesy, cheesy little crackers. We just tried these. Pete, what's your rating? Unreal. Unreal, there we go. Um, these are little breakfast bars just because sometimes I'm angry in the morning if I don't get fed. So that's that. Crunchy cookie M&Ms. We do not get these in the UK, so let's give them a try. Peanut butter M&Ms because they're just the best thing to ever exist. 
Flaming Hot Cheetos. They're also amazing. And we wanted to try these cheddar jalapeno crunchy Cheetos as well. So this is our snacks. Literally cost us $40 for all of this um, <laughs> and two bottles of water. And now we're gonna go. I didn't vlog anything yesterday because we went to Woodbury Common, which is this designer outlet place that's like an hour from New York. So we went into Uptown Manhattan, we got the bus from Port Authority bus station. And then, oh, there's people on the roof, Peter. That's quite fun. Uh, sorry, distracted. Um, and we literally went there, we arrived there about 11 and we got back to the hotel at 9 p.m. So it was a very big day, hello. <laughs> Peter's got very sore feet today. We have been walking so much. We have been walking about 20,000 steps a day. So today we're taking it a bit more easy. We're going to go to some shops. Peter needs to return something. Oh, remember your t-shirt. Um, and then we are going to get the subway over to the Brooklyn Bridge. We're going to walk over the Brooklyn Bridge into Brooklyn, have a walk around there. And then tonight we are going to Broadway to see the Book of Mormon, which I'm very, very excited about. I'm going to show you all of our bags because we bought quite a lot of stuff yesterday. And there was some good deals on in the outlet stores. Oh, Russell, Russell, Russell. Uh, there was quite a few deals on in the outlet stores. So I got some trainers, jacket, a bag, Pete got some shirts and a jacket. Yeah, I'm just gonna show you all the bags now just to give you a bit of perspective of how much we actually bought. Ignore the suitcases, but this is our purchases from yesterday. There's a few different things in the bags because we had to carry the bags back. So we had to try and condense everything into as little bags as possible. This is from the other day, these two. But yeah, we made a good few purchases. The sun is shining today and we are Ready to go out. a lovely walk across the Brooklyn Bridge and now we're going back to chill for a bit 
and then we're going to the theatre. Look at this. to go home but we've had a nice time final day in new york we are walking through central park i feel like we we're supposed to go that way we've gone down trying to find the zoo oh some buildings look yeah we're tired aren't we yeah we're tired we've got a flight back tonight to heathrow at 10 to 7 but we've had a lovely time oh we're going up some steps we've taken lots of pictures we have done a lot of shopping, we've eaten a lot of very, very yummy food. Walked a lot. Walked a lot, like 20,000 steps a day. It's been intense, but it has been very, very good. Aberdeen, the taxi almost crashed. Well, it did crash. It did crash. Uh, <laughs> crashed into another car. So we had to pull over at the side of the road while they had a dispute. It took us an hour and a half to get to the airport. And we managed to spend $50 in the airport on two beers, some chips or fries as they call them, and a packet of cheesy crackers. <laughs> Money but well spent. Money well spent. We had a nice walk around the park earlier and now we are ready to eat something on the plane and have a, a sleep. See you Bye. back, see you back in the UK. Okay. Do you want to do the thing with the hand? You go. <laughs> no, you need to slap it. Smack. 